welcome to How to Teach Journal Writing. The next kind of paper we're going to use is called interlined paper because you have a top line, a bottom line, and then in between you have a dashed line. It's in between the lines, so it's interlined. Anyway, what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how to write what I wrote on the last page and I'll even bring it out so you can see it. I'm going to write that on this page. So at the top, I'm going to write the date. Something to notice about my writing as well is that my tall letters are all the same height and my short letters are all the same height. So this is the top of my head, this is when I sit on a chair, and this is my feet. This is the ground. Some letters, like the P, have feet that dangle down. You can see over here on story that the Y dangles down too. His feet are hanging down. Now I'm going to start my story. I want to write a story. So, starting, because there's no margin on this paper, I'm going to start close to the edge. I... And I don't think story's going to fit over here, so I'm going to put it directly underline, underneath the eye. And the period. Just like on this paper, we have the top line, which is like your head, the middle line, which is like the chair, and the bottom line, which is like the ground, and then the Y has his feet hanging, dangling down. 